Oh, okay. Seems okay. All right, that's good. Yeah, I don't. I, I guess restarting the PC sort of did the trick. <laughs> so, right, let's crack on, shall we? So, last time around, there was. What's it say? Has poorly got an overground growth indicator. Expert mining gloves now work on amethyst and much more besides. Another post? Wow. Huh. Let's have a quick look at that. Quality of life changes. Prayer skill guide now shows the icon for each prayer rather than a holy symbol. Stuff, stuff, stuff. Bunch of stuff I don't know. Uh oh. Oh god. Premier Club 2019 Gold Membership will not be available after Sunday, March the 3rd. Shit. Better sort that out then. <laughs> That's something I'll have to keep an eye on. Gotta get my gold subscription in. Or at least aside by March the 3rd anyway. Yeah. Alright, so. Last time around. I, uh... Unfortunately, we perished while doing this quest. But it did teach me one important thing. And I'm going to need to train agility. And so, I'm going to go and train agility! That is, as soon as I can figure out where this agility arena is located. So, I'm on the hunt for an agility arena. Whatever that is, is the question. Let's see. Agility, 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 agility. Where do I need to be looking for this, I wonder? It's not in the desert, is it? There's a mage training arena in the desert. Some ruins, city, quarry. Agility pyramid, but that's not the agility arena I seek. Ah, here it is. It's on Karajmar Island. Right. So we need to take a trip to Courage Mar and head to that agility arena. And so that is where I'm going to go. And train my agility for a bit. How are you both us anyway? Have you had a good day? Has the day treated you well? Etc, etc. <laughs> is Pineapple still here? Yeah, I think the first agility place is in the Gnome Village. Alright. We also said low level agility arena obstacles. So we're gonna need 30 coins for a trip to Garage Mar. And that should be about it, really. actually know where the known village is but apparently we can do all level agility arena obstacles so I'm gonna head there and I shall train my agility accordingly there's a poll running cast a poll visit the poll booth to cast your vote hmm. so yeah because we failed on this quest we are gonna train our agility quite a bit to make sure that we don't fail it again. It seems like if I'm going to buy that 12 month membership package, I'm going to have to do it quite soon. Hmm. I will bury some bones around here. Hmm. Prayer things would seem that different for me. But I digress. 
All right, come on, let's go, let's go. Let's head over. Let's get to that island. Do do. Don't actually need that for it right now. Do do. So we got. So this is the first time I'm really going to be training a member skill. <laughs> Not had too much focus on the member skills up to this point, but now here I am. It looks like shiny dragons on the line. And what a fun skill it is to train. So I have heard. I've heard nothing but excited whispers and hushed tongues about the excitement of agility training. By which I mean everyone universally agrees it's the most tedious skill to train but the most useful. But hey! I'm going to get every skill in 99. There's going to be a lot of tedious training. I mean, I don't want to say how bad it could be because then I would probably will be as bad as I think it is. But anyway. So we need to go back down. So my current plan is to train agility and see how it goes. And then maybe reattempt this quest again with more preparation. Alright, take me to Karinja. We're not going to pay for our way back. Of course. We can teleport back once everything's done. So we need to head... Oh, oh luckily it's not very far. And it's Brimhaven. Apparently this is quite a popular area since I've heard it mentioned quite a bit in chat before this particular s town or city. Guess I might look around as well. Lucifer the 12th. <laughs> Or tropical tree. Oh, we've got some icky icky scorpions. Better watch out. Frankly, the scorpions will pose no problem for me. Whoa, do you see those trees disappearing? Crazy. Looks like this guy's gotta avoid the scorpions. Oh god, lava. Don't get burned. Seems to stop at an odd juncture. Alright, here we are, entering a member's area. Avast ye scurvy land rovers. High seas. Okay, well, here we are. Cabin entrance clerk for the Brimhaven Agility Arena. Oi, Captain. Oi there. Avast ye scurvy swabs. Huh? Don't mind me, parrot. He's cracked Jenny's teacup. So, what is this place? This, me hearty, is the entrance to the Brimhaven Agility Arena. I was digging for buried treasure that I found it. Amused I was, it was a sight to behold. Ah, buried treasure! It was the biggest thing I'd ever seen. It must have been at least a league from side to side. 
It made me list. I was at it. Made me list. I was excited. Ah, oh, get on with it. I'd find a huge cave of all these platforms. I reckon it'd be the ancient civilization that made it. I had to be mighty careful so there was these traps everywhere. Dangerous it was. Ah, oh, danger, danger. Entrance is only 200 coins. So what do I do in the arena? Well, me hearty, it's simple. You can cross between two platforms by visiting the traps of obstacles or string across them. Try and make your way to the pillar that is indicated by the flashing arrow. You receive tickets for taking more than one pillar in a row, so you won't get a ticket from the first pillar, but you will for every platform you tag in a row after that. If you miss a platform, you'll miss out on the next ticket, so try and get every platform you can. When you be done, take the tickets to Jackie over there and she'll exchange them for more stuff. Ah, tag when the green light means tickets. Ah, tag when red light means green light. Thanks, me arty. Thanks. Oh, it's to give him 200 coins. Uh, is there a bank around here? The, ah, oh, for fuck's sake. The... <coughs> Seriously, there's no bank here? I gotta pay. Why does everything cost fucking money in this game? <laughs> Jesus. Fucking money everywhere. But whatever, we have to train agility. Ah, my head. But we have to train agility, so I must do it. I think we always have to pay some fucking coins out my ass, though. Alright, just to make sure I don't get fucked over, I'm taking fucking 9,000 coins with me. There. Now I have no fucking money to deal with this shit. So let's go back to Garage Mart again and... Go to the arena! Ugh. God. So off we go! On our merry adventure, back to Carriage Mar, armed with a wealth of cash. If only running trains your agility. Oh well. I suppose once I get to a... I suppose once I get to a certain point, I won't have to use the agility arena. I can just use some other method instead. Once I've leveled up agility enough times. I mean, I would train it in the swamp, but that's a health risk. <laughs> Between the gas and the penalty for failing, it'd be a health risk. This might be a lot more safer. Oh, that's strange. I seem to have... I wonder if those falls in the pit actually did gain, raise my agility a little bit. I don't, I don't, I don't, I know the only time I've ever bothered with agility has been when I crossed over the bridge and... Eh, uh, probably was that. I don't think falling down the pit in the pyramid gave me any agility points. Did it? It could be possible, but... Well, anyway, let's go back in. But to Carriage Mar, armed with enough money so we can actually use the arena. I hope that we don't suddenly need to.
So, what else is on this island then? There's some quests, there's a house portal, a mining site with a dungeon. It looks like two other transports to go elsewhere, another mining site. Hmm. I guess this agility arena is what makes this Brimhaven a pretty popular place, I guess. There with a genie. Gotta save my run in case I need it for something. <laughs> so back to the bubbling volcano we go. As the trees slowly phase back into the game. Strange how height completely changes where the things are drawn. It's so weird. But anyway. Right then, time to go and access this agility arena. I guess it's downstairs. Pirate Jackie. Ticket trader. Ahoy! What is this place? Welcome to the Prim Haven Agility Arena. If you want to know more, talk to Captain Izzy. He found it. What do you do? I be the Jack of Tickets. I exchange the tickets you collect in the Agility Arena for more stuff. You can obtain more duty experience or some items you won't find anywhere else. Sounds good. I'd like to trade in my tickets, please. Aye, you be on the right track. Okay. Experience, 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 experience. Toad Flex, Snapdragon, Graceful Recoer, and a Pirate's Hook. Alright, oh, so you can exchange the tickets for more agility training, I guess. I wonder if these will ever be useful. Pirate, I'm guessing they might be, they cost a lot of money. Alright, well. Time to use it. I'd like to use the agility arena, please. Aye! Entrance be two hundred coins. Mark, pay to the right! A word of warning, me hearty. There are dangerous traps down there. I'll be fine. Okay, here's two hundred coins. You give him two hundred coins. May the wind be in your sails. Alright, down we go. Whoa, what? Um, Aztec. Am I in the right place here? This seems pretty lethal, actually. I mean, holy shit, there's bats, there's planks, there's lava. Am I? Should I uh, perhaps not come here? This looks extremely dangerous. Like, I could die here. I don't want to do that with any gear on anyway. Annoying flappy thing. Oh god, this place looks extremely dangerous. I don't have a good feeling about this. No, 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 no. Oh god, no. I, I, I am not going in that place. No, fuck that. That is too dangerous for me. I'd have to go there with which we two... Well, I suppose I could do it, but I'm not going to fucking risk all these coins and all my gear. Just give it a try. I'm 
Go away. Go away. Thank you. Alright. Well, that's just really annoying, isn't it? I, I can't even start the fucking training because... I keep having to go back and deposit my stuff. Well... At least now I know... I'm not worried about wizarding the money. I have plenty of money. But it's the time. I have been streaming for 23 minutes. I haven't done anything yet other than discover the agility arena. You did say the gnome village, but... Man, I don't have to... This way, I might as well... That's the fucking swamp. Although that might be really risky due to the element of getting gassed here, I suppose. Alright, well, if... Different. Well done! You have completed an easy task in the Carriage Mart area. Your achievement diary has been updated. Hey, white t-shirts. How you doing? What exactly did I do? Oh. Travel to Port 7. Well, I'm trying to train my agility, white t-shirts. Unfortunately, I then discovered the agility arena is a giant fucking death trap. As if facing one last time wasn't enough, so... I'm going back to the arena, I'm just not going to fucking die and lose all my gear. I no longer trust this game. It set me right anymore. So we're going back to it, but I, until I can get enough agility, I am going to train agility so I can cross the pit. And I'll be able to come prepared next time. I'll be bringing antidotes, food, and fuck the desert shit. I'm going to take armor with me. Full fucking armor of some sort, possibly. Alright, so we're going to bank all of these things. And the boots. Deposit all the coins. Now, we need to withdraw 230. There, that's exactly enough to get us to the island, to the agility leader, and then we have nothing to lose. But plenty to gain. At least we'll be able to find out how dangerous it is. So now, I'm not giving up on this Scarlet. It's... How the fuck do you pronounce that? How do you pronounce it? I'm not giving up. I'm just making sure I have enough agility to cross that pit. I think I'll be fine once I can cross the pit. But then again, I, I don't know. For all I know, after crossing the pit, I may have to fight a level 1000 fucking mummy. I don't think that seems likely, but it's that one pit that stops me from being able to complete it. At any rate. Now you should be fine. Can I cross, please? Thank you, game. Game, please. What are you doing with this wag? Jesus. Hey, it's Derry. Well, the problem is, is that I failed the pit four or five times. Four or five times. I have one agility. One. This is the first time I'm going to spend significant capital in actually... A member skill. And probably the most important one, it would seem. I fell down that pit about five times, Derry. 
And I lost... I didn't lose anything too valuable, thankfully. I kept my cat, and my scimitar, and my amulet. And everything else was expendable, really. But... It was such a time waste. Everyone <laughs> needs at least 70 agility. Well, I don't anticipate going that crazy on it for now, but I'm gonna get, I'm definitely gonna raise it up. And so I'm gonna go to the agility arena and not fear death. If anything, if I die pretty quickly, I know it's a horrible place to go and I'll just go. Honestly, I would be really tempted to almost just go to the swamp and just quit that bridge. Sure, there's gas, but fuck it. Then again, if I die in the swamp, I turn into a gas, so it's perhaps not the best idea. Now, why would someone close the gate there? Leave it open. Right, anyway, now we can go to the agility arena and actually do what we need to do. So, pay the, f pay the guy. Now let's go. Right, here we are. Now we just hope not to die. But no, I don't know where that is. Go to work. Okay, I gained some agility. It did suggest the gnome stronghold, but maybe he can't reach that. Get on that plank. That gives me a little bit. Spooky! Congratulations! You just advanced an agility level. Your agility level is now two. Hooray! I gained an agility level. Which allows me to not really use that much. No stronghold agility course. Oh, I see. The, the planks change. Yeah, the most efficient thing to do is to gnome to 10 and rooftops until you get to 50. Then the 50, you'll boost the level required for wilderness course. Then you'll do that until 60 and then head to Sears and the time you 67 agility is all graceful. see annoying flappy thing so whereabouts is this gnome I'm guessing walking on the other two planks is not a good idea here so it'll lead to death <laughs> Yo, is there platforming in this game? Well, this is agility training. <laughs> this is what we have to do for agility training. Walk on a plank. I don't trust my character to suddenly swing on the rope swing somehow. At least not yet, anyway. What this course is good for is for the tickets because they allow you to do stored experience. So if you hit 100 of hours, you can save up tickets and do day records with the agility skill. Yeah, I noticed there was a ticket seller. They were selling experience, but they were also selling um, a pirate hook and a graceful core thing. Oh, I'm a duty level three, and I accidentally didn't quite mean to click off that. Alright, so we're getting there. Our duty level is increasing. Very slowly, but it's getting there. The Dongo's Cavern.
I'm guessing that graceful thing then was a uh, that the ticket guy was selling was part of a graceful set or something. I think I was told about the graceful set is very good for agility. Oh, hey. Ah, but the only way to get graceful is to spend marks of grace, which you can wise on rooftop agility cards in the graceful set. It's extremely important for an account to have. Oh, I, I can't. I don't think it was graceful, but it must have been. It was. It was something that was on offer here. Colorful something. Or other. When you were graceful, it was the way of your characters to be able to run longer. Yeah, I've been told it also increases your regen as well. This. Yeah, that's kind of something I'd like to have because that's the big thing I wanted to work on when I became a member. So I was told that agility would help with my uh, running regen. So conversely, I thought it was a good idea. Level four. Nice. We're doing it. All right, should we try tag ticket dispenser? All right, let's see what else we can get away with here. Let's see if we can walk on this log. Don't fall, don't fall, don't fall. Hold on, we didn't fall. All right. Oh God, there's a suede. Ugh. Run! That was close. I need an agility level of at least 40 to get past this trap. Oh. Right. Alright. Let's try another way then. Come on. You can do it. You can do it. You can do it. Well done. Yeah, there we go. Looks suspiciously like a pressure pad to me. Lost my balance, apparently. Darn. Oh, hold on. Tag. You get tickets by tagging more than one pillar in a row. Tag the next pillar for the tickets. Alright. Sure. Okay. I guess we tag this one. You can only get a ticket when the flashing arrow is above the pillar. I thought I just did that. Weird. Tag. It says tag the next pillar. Oh, I guess it means when it next moves or something. Okay, come on, come on, come on, come on. Almost there. Nice, well done. Run, run you. Why did he not run when I asked him to? All right, now go, 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 go. No, no. don't go off you jackass. Jeez. I find it weird you've never played Rootscape. Okay, try again. Come on. Come on. Yeah, there we go. Oh, man. 
Man, I can't avoid that trap either. Alright, let's go. Monkey bars. Go, 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 go. Go. Oh, Jesus. Come on. Get on those monkey bars. Okay, go, 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 go. Go, go, go. You did it. Yeah, well done. Ah, oh, that's you. That, jeez. I need an agility level of 40 to get past this trap. Oh. Okay. I guess we can't get that. I guess we can't get that one then. Come on. Come on. Yeah, well done. Oh, God. I didn't want him to go back. Yeah, that's what you get. I didn't want you to go back, you dumbass. We need to. Okay. Try the rope swing. I am now level five. I could use the Fowador Agility Shortcuts. I guess. Oh, I need to be level 20 to get past that one. Oh yeah, I guess I could try that rope swing. Alright. Well, let's see if we can get back across safely first. Alright. No, oh, you fucking idiot. Come on! It's all good though. We're getting some good experience off this. Oh man, Rev P, you are embarrassing yourself in front of all these people. Okay, get across the monkey bars. You've done it several times. I know it was lava below. Oh, Rev P, you're just embarrassing yourself. Come on. I think I'll start popping the region. His arms are tired. He's doing it. He's doing it. He's doing it. Yeah. Okay, rope swing. Here we go. Oh, that went well. It likes how he hangs in the air. Yeah, it's like, wah, I'm falling. What is going on? Okay, come on. You can do this. Yeah. Oh, no. There's a pillar that I can tag, I think. Get back over. Have I done the quest biohazard? I somehow missed the rope completely. I have not, no, Dowie. Um, I have uh, not done a lot as a member so far. <laughs> to be honest. Jeez, man, this is getting annoying. I've only done a few quests. I've done Lost City, Nature Spirit, Priest in Peril, and Gertrude's Cat. I've never been a member before, so... He did it! He did it! And the thing changed already. So I can't even actually get across there. A gnome course. I might go after I die here. I have nothing to lose, so I'm happy to keep doing this for a bit. Until I die. Okay, I can't... Oh, I can't really do anything else here. I'm stuck. <laughs> do that one. That's the, that's the safest one I can do. Oh, uh, that spikes below. Uh, oh, no. I was impaled. 
I somehow survived, didn't land, I somehow survived landing not on the spikes. So, but yeah, I've never been a member in this game before, so all this is new experience for me. Okay, come on, come on. Yes, yes, yes. Yeah, there we go, all right. Uh, I am on world 302. Hey, there we go, level six. And I have reached a total level of 600, finally. No, oh, Rev P keeps dying. Alright, try again. Can do this. I have confidence in you, Rev P. I have confidence in you. I made it. See, I got this. Oh, I need to go at V level 20. Okay. Go! Go! Nice. Okay, we could we could do this, maybe. There you go. Oh, he got hit too. Oh no, I can't get over there. Because I can't get past that trap. And this guy is also struggling with the same trap. Did you just do a matrix bullet time? Ah, I landed on the spikes. But I'm not dead. That's alright, I'm good. How have I not managed to be impaled by now? I've landed on the spikes twice and I've somehow just brushed it off. I'm very resilient. Surprisingly. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh! Oh, I can't make it to that one either. And I can't get down that one either. Fuck. It's all one way street because I don't have enough. I'm as tough as nails. Yeah, that must be it. But I'm not very agile. I am very, uh... These weapons are nails. Jeez! Come on. Get over that bloody area. Let's go, let's go! Wow, I'm... I'm not as agile as nails, I'm only six. Du, 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 du. Come on, come on. No. Come on. Come on. Yeah. There you go. And thank you for the whole six. Oh, I can't go around there either. Let's go all the way back just to do this. Alright. Tag, 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 tag. Come on. Come on. Come on. Yeah, well done. Come on. Come on. You can do it. You can do it. Yes. Oh, you son of a bitch. It changed the tag designation. Just as I was just as I was about to get over there, it changed. So now I have to go all the way around the longer way. Okay. Do not get killed by the soul blade. Do run. I swear my character looks like he's really close to just wanting to stop on the blade. What I'm finding more miraculous is I'm somehow not falling in the lava. 
I'm, I'm not agile enough to always stay on these monkey bars, but I do avoid falling into the lava. And burning myself immediately. So I got that going for me, I guess. Wait, 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 no, no, oh, oh, God. Now he's gone over. Too late, my character is... At least he made it. I'm not high enough level to be rooftops yet. There was either this or the gnome village. Hey, second gen. Oh no, he fell off again. I am now a duty level six. I've actually trained here for a little bit. Eventually. I have no gear on, so I'm just going to do this until I perish, I guess. Which I can't say is very efficient, unless I brought some food with me. Then I can do this for a lot longer, but... I should have thought about that, actually. I, mean, I should have brought some food with me. Well, at least I know what to expect for next time. Seeing if I... No, oh, come on! Yeah, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go to the no one afterwards. All right, can I make this jump? Come on, come on, Red P. You can do it. Yeah, there you. Go. I am now level seven, and I missed the announcement. So I'm level seven. Every level means one less trouble of being in the pit. Okay. My prayer is almost running out here for my HP regen buff. Come on, we can do it. Yes! Oh no, it changed again! Oh, are you kidding me? No, FP! No, don't go onto the fucking monkey bars now! I wanna go back over. Great, I do it again. No, he's still at Tom level 10 anyway. Yeah, someone just brutefully told me what I'm supposed to be doing. Okay, go, go, go. That's it. That's it. Oh, God, I could never do that in real life. Well, my prayer points have expired. Okay, you just gotta go over this pillar set. Tag that pillar. Just gotta do it. Come on. No. You son of a bitch. Get over there. Good thing you missed this morning, by the way. Why is that? Jump. 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 They accidentally spawned a one billion... Item on the ground had to roll back the servers. <laughs> wow. That's interesting. Oh, come on. I thought I had it then. I had to do a quest twice. Oh, wow. That sucks. I'm on my last health. I've only got one HP left, Rev P. You can make it. No! Rev P, why you do this? And I'm dead. Pfft. Great, I perished. <laughs> I died horrendously. Stay there. Alright, I might have time to go to the gnome village, I guess. Well, at least I didn't lose anything since I was naked, so always good. You'll take me to the gnomes. What about this is gnome village anyway? I gained six levels, so that was a pretty good run. Ah uh, yeah, rooftop courses on Draenor, Alcared. Yeah, all kinds of places for rooftop courses. 
But it sounds like rooftop courses are the way to go for agility. I'm going to attack you because you looked at me funny. So I'm angry. Taste my fist. Now I have cash. Ah! Uh, I don't think I can pickpocket them yet. I stand corrected. I actually can. I can try to pickpocket them. Alright. See if I can get away with it. Ow! That didn't work at all. He stunned me. Haha! <laughs> Picked his pocket and a coin pouch. Nice. I complete an easy task in the one bridge in Draenor area. Pickpocket a man or woman. Alright. See if there's anything else on him. Oh no, it didn't work. Your barrels as run has gone super dry. One hundred and ten chests and one item. Yoink! I got it. I got you cornered now. Ha ha ha! I am taking all your money. Six brothers. Oh god, there's a person behind me. Ugh, I'm so scared. I'm gonna have to punch you out now. Dari wishes to trade with you. How is this man suddenly. Come on! God, punch out this guy. I punched out skeletons the less. There you go. There. A grimy Harlander. It needs cleaning. Alright. Well, there's... What, what, what's this? Games necklace. Amulet of glory? What are these, exactly? Games necklace. Amulet of glory. What are these? What are these... Oh, I know what the Amulet of glory is. Oh, the teleportation devices. Okay. Uh, sure. Alright, I guess I'll take those. Use game necklace to teleport to Barbarian. Then, oh, right, I see. So the, oh, I see. Wait, I already have one of these amulets, I think. Well, thank you. I thought I was going to the Gnome Village. Okay. Examine. The Enchanted Necklace. Alright, I guess we'll use the games one then. Oh, where would you like to teleport to? Therefore, Barbarian Outpost. Okay. Whoosh! What, what, where, where's, where's this? I just teleported somewhere completely different. I didn't know we were going to go to a... Where the hell are we? Whoa, holy crap. We are... Way in the middle of Member's Turf. Hey, there's an agility arena here. Your name's necklace has seven uses left. Alright. Sure. Buddy, yeah, we're seeing some sights today. I guess you want to run, okay. You know, walk me to the no. Okay. I thought we were going to go to the other barbarian village. I didn't know there was one in, there was never one in Membersville. Jeez. <laughs> Tarry the Uber surface, yeah. Voyage. Wow, this is a big hill. Oh 
all the things we will see and the things we will have. Now we have Waterfall. I think someone, I think Omnitus gave me an amulet of glory. I probably can rub that as well. Hmm. An unexpected journey. Yeah, it is a bit like the Hobbit, doesn't it? A traveling merchant. For a second, oh wow, you've got agility skills cape. I guess that's the agility skill cape since it's got running on it. <laughs> merch, oh, march, not merch, march. <laughs> Now, Neverland. Huh, lamp's cool. Quit the gate and do what the gnome tells you. Holy moly, a gnome place. Alright. Hello there. Hi. Could you help me lift these boxes? They are really heavy. Okay. Thanks, Traveler. Thanks again, friend. Uh, sure, no problem. Whoa. So, I guess we are in the cute creature. Oh, isn't it cute? A tree. Oh shit, babe. Oh, you. Wow, a land of gnomes. Gnome village. Gnomed! I guess you could say the entire chat has been gnomed. So it doesn't really count when they're in the game, does it? bit different when they're in the game and stuff. Why is this it? Is this the uh, it? Don't listen to White, he's telling the truth. Agility is such a huge quality of life upgrade. This is it. This is the entire stronghold. One walk. Alright, I'm just trying to get my bearings here. Wow, the gnomes have quite a lot of area. So we went from here, all the way down here through a bunch of stuff and arced around there. Okay, wow. Well, thank you very much for directing me here, um, Dally. I guess now we shall walk across it. Yay, I did it, woo! All oh, right, it's not just the log. Move it, move it, move it. That's it, straight up. A gnome trainer. He can advise on training. Hello, what is this place? This, my friend, is where we train. Here we prove our agility. It's an essential skill. Looks easy enough. If you complete the course in order from the slippery swamp to the end, your duty will increase much faster than by repeating just one obstacle. Ah, oh, baby. <laughs> Come on, scurdy cat. Get across that rope. Once you hit 10, you will teleport to Draenor and start your rooftops courses. My granny can move faster than you. Wow, you cheeky buggers. Let's squeeze in. 
Oh, there we are. Very nice. And I am now level 8. Members can now cross the river one with a mithril grapple. Nice. I have completed an easy task in the Western Provinces area. Western Provinces, huh? Which is complete a lap of the No Majority course. Nice. Have you considered applying at Jiggets to do and you can teleport to Draenor via the Glory Amulets? Alright. Nice. Well, thank you very much for that, um, Dari. Thank you for showing me this area. This will be very useful for my agility training. Without a doubt. And I can go back to Draenor and I can use the, um... I what I'm doing. Chill out. Move it, move it, move it. Move it! So once I hit level 10, I start doing run. At 20, the next rooftop course. Yeah, the guide is showing me all the rooftops. And I believe the rooftop courses are very useful. They give you the graceful marks you've been saying. This is what I need. Nice. We got the big boost at the end there. Whee! Yes, if you put on quests and such, Graceful is very needed. Well, believe me, I met enough problems doing that quest last time. I'm gonna... This is the one skill I've wanted to train. Of all the members' stuff. Because it opens up all those shortcuts, and it seems that agility is used for everything else. <laughs> Some nice animations being shown for these movements, by the way. Oh, we're level 9! One more level and that'll be it. Damn, this makes you want to play old school RuneScape again. Ugh, there's some blood splatter. I guess some gnomes are falling down. <laughs> well, if your granny can move faster, then why ain't she doing this course then, Mr. Gnome? Huh? Why ain't she doing this course? One more time, I think we'll be done. This is going to be a cool place to walk around later on when I do some gnome quests. I know that there'll be a few. Oh, Adji, feel free to ask any questions you may add. Uh, your name is D... Space... Yeah, I was about to say, I could happily add you to my list of friends. Sure. I think... Oh, there we go. I mean, I don't want to be told everything. You know, this is my first time as a member, so I want to find some stuff out on my own, but having some helpful hints like that is always appreciated. Okay, level 10. You can now use the Draenor Village course, cross the rope swing to Moss Giant Island, and use the Corsier Cove shortcut. Nice. Alright. So then I rope this amulet and wow. These seem really useful. I need to get one of these teleporting necklace things. Edgeville, Carriage Mar, Draenor Village, Alcared, nowhere. <laughs> well, I guess we're going to Draenor Village. Whoosh. Alright, well. Your amulet has five charges left. Sweet. Well, 
now I actually have to leave the house. Yeah, no problem, uh, Terminator. I think I will deposit these for now. And they'll be useful later on. I thought I had an amulet of glory, actually. Oh, no, it's an amulet of power, not glory. This is different. Okay, well, apparently there's a rooftop course here somewhere. I wonder where I go for that. Hmm. Northeast. And thank you for the follow. It's Danny. Barry. I knew he said Danny then. <laughs> for some reason. But thank you very much for the follow. Northeast, then north. Oh, there's a marker here. Ah, I see. I guess that marker is a, the giveaway. You'll see. Alright, I might have time to do one lap of this before I head to focus, so what the heck. Let's do it! Up the wall! Oh, nice! I'm on the rooftop! Wow! Look out, Denizians! I tower above you. I had a feeling these tight ropes were something to do with agility. Owing to the fact that... I've seen these for ages, and I had a feeling they were something to do with agility. It's kind of cool, but I'm walking literally across the entirety of the town. Alright, what do I get off here then? Oh! Oh wow, go along this wall. I am to balance on the wall. Okie dokie. Just like some Assassin's Creed stuff, this. Are we up? Right. Um. Now what? Oh right, I jumped the gap. <laughs> nice. Oh right, we use a crate to climb down. This is, this reminds me of Assassin's Creed, jumping on all the houses and stuff. Well done! You have completed an easy task in the Wombridge and Draino area. Your achievement diary has been updated. Complete a lap of the Draino Village Agility Course. Nice. <laughs> yeah, Hardcore Parkour. Oh, Escape Edition. Nice. All I do now is get this to 35 and I'll be able to go back to that tomb. It's pretty sweet. Da, 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 da. And I guess this is what I do until I get whenever. <laughs> Just keep crossing the same room, same areas over and over and over again. <laughs> I kind of like how it uses the game world for the course. That's pretty cool. Yeah, you... Ow, I fell off. God damn it. Did it first time before. Now I can now I'm struggling to repeat the trick. <laughs> Alright, one more attempt and then I'm gonna have to head off. But thank you for that help, Derry. <laughs> uh just about, yeah. I've got I made off to a poker game. I also stream other things, by the way, it's Derry, in case you're wondering. This is my long-term chill stream project. Uh, it has two goals. Uh, get all my skills to 99 and complete all the quests on here. Every single one of them. It's something that's going to take me a while to do. But I also play old-school first-person shooters. So it's not all just RuneScape. And I'm now level 11. Should I can't go on that building? That would have been cool. But, oh, what's this? Mark of Grace. 
Ah, that's what I want to collect, isn't it? You can exchange these for the wards at the Rogue's Den. Ah, these are what I want to gather then. The Marks of Grace. Brilliant. Sweet. I need to check... I need to go find this Rogue's Den at some point, I guess. Alright, well, that's going to be it for this... Yeah, you'll want 260 of those for a full set. 260. I'll make a note of that, Barry. Thank you. All right, well, that's going to be it for this part. Um, I finally started training agility. And I'm going to keep on training agility until I have enough agility to overcome the terrors of the City of the Dead. So thank you all for watching. And next time around... I'm going to walk on these rooftops a whole bunch. See you later, everybody.